Breeders Cup or Bust paid a visit to Walkin' in Circles Ranch. We're just outside of Albuquerque, New Mexico on a beautiful day. This is an operation that's supported by Thoroughbred Charities of America, so when you make donations to Breeders Cup or Bust, these are the kinds of places that you're supporting through Thoroughbred Charities of America. They're taking in horses that have been neglected or starved, they train them, adopt most of them out. It's a terrific operation. We get most of our horses from the New Mexico Livestock Board and they're seizures or surrenders and basically they're cruelty cases and most of them are starvation cases. The Livestock Board sees them out of a, a cruelty investigation and the horses were so dehydrated and so emaciated uh, we didn't expect them to live through the day. We have from 92 to 117 active volunteers that spend 10 hours or more at the ranch. I think the average time, uh, the last I looked, the average time for each of those volunteers is about 17 and a half hours at the ranch. I have more fun coming out here. I, I retired last year. Ray, if you look and see some of the things, some of the some of the things we've done for some of these horses, it's amazing. So I go home at night and I can sleep really well, <laughs> knowing what I did, not what I didn't get done. Or this is Martellus. His registered name is Martellus, and I bet he was amazing when he was running. Uh, he ran as a two-year-old and won his first race as a two-year-old, and those are the only records that we could find on him. So now we know what she is, now we have to find out who she is. <laughs> the Dutchman there is Opal, and Opal is 37 years old this year. And this mare is one of our thoroughbreds, and I think she's about, hey, she's about uh, 31, 32. Uh, and uh, all, none of these horses have all their teeth, so we uh, give them a what we call alfalfa soup. We soak hay cubes and mix in some uh, vitamins and, and uh, nutrients. The biggest challenge is raising funds to keep it going. Uh, but uh, we're out working every day just to raise the funds to keep it going.